Well, welcome. We, we're here to uh, talk about OER resources being used more effectively. Our team is iLearn, and we are a web and mobile interface that contextually matches learners to learners, to mentors, to resources, to facilitate lifelong learning. So there are many resources that are out there, and there are many reasons and ways in which people need to use them. So we have a matching algorithm who will then match our learners. So please, take it over, matching algorithm. Thank you. Uh, so our highly sophisticated matching algorithm takes into account the information that's provided on our dashboard, which includes um, our age, our ability level, which is demonstrated by badges that we've earned, um, our interests, the type of media that's most interesting to us, our learning styles, content area, and a variety of other indicators that help us choose the re most relevant resources that are going to be applicable to us. So from, we have our learner who's interested in learning about math, specifically insert content or competency here. Uh, and then we have a variety of resources, open education resources that we can choose from. Based on the information provided in our profile, um, I know as the matching algorithm that our learner wants to connect with uh, a mentor. She's interested in getting some educational videos that she can learn from. She wants to see, a, she wants to hear a podcast by an expert, and she wants to, she wants to uh, do some interactive games that'll help her learn. Now, we have a great set of resources here that are relevant for others, but they don't specifically match what our learner is looking for. So once that learner has an opportunity to work with those resources, then? Then she actually remixes some of the resources and then puts them back into the learning pool. Thank you, remixed resource. <laughs> and of course, her dashboard is, is continually updated. As you can imagine, there are many resources that are out there. Some of them have been used, some have not. What we're doing is looking at contextually matching based on lifelong learning interest of learners to their resources. And this can be a web app, uh, a iPhone app. It can also power collab number three's Celestial City. <laughs> Is that a yes, Celestial City? <laughs> yeah, that's what we were thinking about. It was lots of fun to put together. Thank you very much. <laughs>